CC Victoria is a bus company that provides uh, operations in the west of Melbourne. It has an operation at Geelong, Ballarat and Oakley as well. So the West is a fast-growing area of Western Melbourne and the government has spent $4 billion into this network in terms of a new regional railway link and our networks are fundamentally serving those areas. Uh, we started out with the community engagement plan to really to deal with antisocial behaviour and giving back the driver respect within the community is something which has eroded over time and is something we want to try and restore. The CDC association with the Brotherhood of St. Lawrence is largely based on the, the ability to give back to the disadvantaged within the community and the focus on the disadvantaged in the West. The CDC have been working with us at the Brotherhood to enable us to get into the communities in which we've identified poverty exists. So this is a true strategic partnership in every sense. And public transport is amenable to people. So at the Brotherhood of St. Lawrence, we're very excited about the bus that CDC's donated. We're looking at it as being a one-stop employment bus. They have access to computers and to printers, and they have trained specialists to go through their resume, print that off, and get them on the road to employment. CDC have great passion, so every time I deal with them, they're engaged and passionate and excited about the prospects of a long-term partnership. I'm the Chief Commercial Officer of the Western Bulldogs. Our whole strategy is around the West of Melbourne. We have 60 schools, for example, that we engage with out in the West, and a lot of those kids would actually get buses which CDC runs, so there's so many parallels each and every day that we share. The Witten Project is something that we're really passionate about, a 12-week leadership course where young 14 to 17 year olds learn all about leadership. It's great for us to be able to find new emerging leaders, but to have a partner like CDC on board is even more important because we're actually then making new leaders of the Western region as we move forward over the next 10 to 15 years. Essentially with our partnership with the Bulldogs, what we have done is now worked very closely with them on the men's health program that they call the Sons of the West. The stats for men's health, especially in the Western Melbourne, are very poor, so both of us saw the opportunity that we could make a difference and we've had over 2,000 men sign up this year which is double than we had last year. The more we can bring our partners together to work together, the better we're off we're all going to be. And Victoria University have been a partner for nearly 30 years at the club. They've got the naming rights to the Witten Oval. There's 50,000 students who go to Victoria University in the west of Melbourne. Long-term sustainable partners like CDC have been perfect for that. CDC Victoria have very kindly supported two scholarships through our Achievement Scholarships program. So the two scholarship recipients are Year 12 students who are just starting their tertiary education. So it makes a huge difference to those students to be supported throughout their education by a great company like CDC. The idea of getting two Victorian University scholarships, which is a university based in the West and focus on the West. I think education is not just for the few, it's for all. So I think that shared commitment is the basis of our relationship. The one thing that we have noticed is that it's largely the youth that we want to try and reach out to and occasionally we could be targets for the youth as well. Victoria Maori Wardens are volunteers and they take their time to ride our buses to reach out to their youth in the community. I see a lot of the Māori Pacific Islanders in custody and that drives my passion as a chairman for the organisation. The organisation is made up of volunteers in the community. We're not a security company. We're there to engage with our kids and help them redirect them and mentor them through education and uh, employment. Our partnership with CDC started when the drivers and the company approached us to assist through the use of the buses. Our presence has more of an impact than anything. We love what we do because we're helping at least one person for that night. I really do believe that CDC practice what they preach. CDC staff see the passion that Victoria Māori Wardens see as well. Passionate, I think, a professional, engaged, genuine, caring. I think all of those qualities and values are things we share. If I was anyone out there who was passionate about what they do, were community orientated, were really strong in the values that they set, I would be telling you to ring CDC and partner with them. I want the partnership between the Brotherhood of St Lawrence and CDC to start winning awards, to be recognised, to stand out as an organisation that has corporate responsibility, that truly delivers what it says it's going to deliver. It's the community that we serve, it's the community that gives us a, a, a rationale for being really. Mm -hmm.